How's it going everyone? Today's focus is the haunted sectors. For this main objective, you're going to be killing a bunch of mobs, <laughs> farming a bunch of candy, uh, spawning all the headless ones until your timer runs out and then you'll be defeating the boss. Doesn't matter how many headless ones you kill. Nope, not really for the boss objective. Uh, just depends on how to, uh, how to progress through. You wanna get as many of the headless ones as you can for triumphs or candy farming and such. And the way you do this is you stand in the objectives that are marked up. You're gonna see one that's marked up for objective to stand in. It's real quick, it's a summoning ritual. You stand inside, summon the big guy up there, and then do massive damage to it. If you, once you knock it out, then you can go to the next objective. You're gonna do this over and over and over until your time uh, runs out, and then the boss spawns. The best recommendation for weapons to deal with these headless ones, especially when you get into the legend haunted sectors, is gonna be something that's close quarters, so conditional finality, Wither Horde is pretty nice, as you can just dot it up and not have to run away. Um, anything that's going to be good for really close quarters, shotguns. Also for the boss, it's really good to have some nice shotguns going on for big damage. Um, you really want to have something that does really good crack control. So, for Warlocks, I'd recommend Arc or Void. Void goes with the Surge currently. For Hunters, I would say Strand. Strand is insane with all the Beyblades going around. Along with Solar is going to be very, very good. Also, throwing your knives around and making that pretty easy for you. And then for Titans, I would say Strand Titans are going to be the best. They'll be able to just control everything. Uh, the main job would be of the Strand Titan would be to just run around and kill everything and then let one of your Warlocks who's going to sit back uh, and control the objective and spawn it in. Strand Titans will be absolutely insane for Banner of War right now. And then you can run Solar Titan also to control the battlefield easily. So anything that's going to give you a lot of super energy back that allow you to destroy all these things really fast is the best way to go. So once your timer runs out, the boss is going to spawn in the middle. This will have this will be different for each of the four different haunted sectors. So the current one you're seeing now is on the moon, but they could change the EDZ and such. So same objective is going to be summoning the headless ones, defeating it, and then you're going to get these little pumpkin bombs you're going to want to shoot off. You're going to throw those at the boss. So I would say take your time, grab one, everyone grab one, and run at the boss. Don't just throw it randomly. <laughs> Hope it hits. Try to make sure it actually hits the shield. Three, sh three at the shield, then you can destroy it. Uh, so you can go right into DPS phase. On normal difficulty, it's rather easy just to stomp all these um, headless ones and then the boss. When you get to legend, you got to be a little more safe with how you play, especially if you're going for a flawless for the triumphs. So play it smart. Go in there with some big damage. Be prepared that it's going to be a little messy with a lot of ad clear. So if you got some arc, run best for radius to get that uh, blind going on, help you out. But stand the rituals, summon the headless ones, and then defeat the boss. And rather than that, it's pretty easy. So let me know in the comments below what you think of these. They should be real smooth and real good for candy farming. You do want to make sure you have your spectral paper before you even go in. So that way when you kill the headless ones, they'll then change over to the other paper versions for you. So you get those from different content, not the haunted sectors. But hope this helps. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Comment below what you think. And as always, hope you have a fantastic day.